And I was reading the comparison of the 365 cheaper brand to the other gluten-free brand. And the 365 had canola oil. And I just don't understand, like it is known. But the problem is the number one reason why you should avoid seed oils is um, they are high in omega-6s. Now we all hear about omega-3s, like, you know, omega-3 fatty acids, like inner factor four. They're high in omega-6s and we need to have a balance, a, a ratio between our omega-6 to three. Do you know that ratio off the top of your head? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I feel like it's like I don't miss one, me. I know. I feel like it's like one to four. I cannot remember right now. But there's a ratio of your omega-6 to omega-3. And the problem is we're not getting enough omega-3 and we're getting way too much omega-6, which causes so much inflammation in our body. So that's like the number one thing, besides the fact that seed oils are highly processed. They strip it of nutrients and antioxidants, mm -hmm. um, biggest things. And then obviously we all know added sugars. Sugar is like, sugar is the enemy. It Big really time. is. Now I'm not Big talking time. about a piece of fruit or something maybe made with dates. Those are all like, you know. Yeah, natural sources. Yeah, natural sources that you still need to have in moderation. Again, you moderation do. is key. But the added sugars in anything and everything we're eating, it adds up and it is so inflammatory and causes so many diseases. So 